what happened? Let's begin at the beginning. So she started talking to me. She said, I'm going to leave soon. I couldn't hear her because she had lost her voice. She was saying, I'm going to leave soon. You can have my shares. Right. And so I sat down. I said, I can't hear you. She said, yeah, I lost my voice. I, I teased her a little bit about losing her voice. She laughed. Then we started talking. I called me DHV, called me DHV, teased her a lot. I, uh, I was just following, you know, classic mystery method. Alright. It was all going great. You qualified her? Multi a lot, yeah. Great. 8 to 12 minutes. Alright. Properly qualified. And I had to go back and neck her multiple times because she was testing me. Yeah. She was like, oh, I'm not the romantic type. I don't want to kiss you. I did this multiple times. I oh, need to speak. But I didn't let her face me. Yep. Yeah. She asked me to walk with her to the, to the door. So we walked and then we just kept on walking. Um, we got to a place, she said she was hungry, should I get food? I said yes, we should get food. But I think I found a great routine for the comfort phase. She had these wireless uh, headphones. She put one in mine here, yeah. one in hers, and she was constantly playing her favorite music. It was like... I do that to girls. It's, it's a great routine. We've done that in Moscow. Yeah, in Moscow. You, you can do this can bit. It's an awesome routine because yeah. that was trust. We do this. We do this. Okay, awesome. So um, she did it to you? Yes. Yeah, it was great. We were just sitting, eating, kissing, dancing, um, getting close, getting further away. Push but, pull. Yeah, push pull. And then I seated the pool. I said we should go free drink at my place. And she said, yeah, I'm going to go get ready. I asked her if she had roommates. She said, yeah, she's here with three other girls. So I didn't want to go upstairs. I just dropped her off. And so now I'm back here, she texted me, she said, hey, um, I said, hey, are you ready? Or did you, did you, she's a sharp one. Did you get dressed already? Did you get ready already? She hasn't responded, but yep. I don't know. <laughs> that, that was a great set. That was a great set. And you made out with her. Yeah. Congratulations. Good times. <laughs> this yeah. was a good night for you. I'm amazing. That was the fourth girl? Fifth set, I think. Fifth set. And that was a hot girl. You, you landed a hot girl there. I know. <laughs> it's great. This is absolutely amazing. It works. Yeah. <laughs> You're a genius. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> there you go. You kissed her? Yeah, I kissed her. It was like we were walking and she was dancing and I started videoing her. And she was dancing for the video, it was like for the camera. It was great. And then I just stopped her, you know, looked deep into her eyes and I was like, I can't, I can't hold this anymore. Yeah. Went for the kiss. That easy. Yeah. Nice. Proud of you, brother. Proud of you. Can we see that video? Um, of her dancing? Yes. Great boot camp. Great boot camp. Vegas, baby. Everyone's in set. Everyone's winning. Hey guys, it's Mystery calling you from Bali, Indonesia. I'm in paradise. Sometimes you have to grind to find. And we found our bubble of love. The next bubble of love will be in Las Vegas. And you are invited. I'm going to teach the elegant art of the cold approach pickup to a small select group of men. 
ready to train with me. Are you one of them? If you have interest in learning from me this year in 2020, then give me a contact. We've got a lot to talk about. I'll catch you up to speed in a game I absolutely love. The Cold Approach Pickup.